hello everyone welcome back in this video we will see about modifying and copying files to host so uh, basically we will see about the files modules so the files modules library that includes uh, modules which will allow you to accomplish uh, most of the task which is uh, related to the Linux file management for example uh, creating copying editing and modifying the file uh, permissions and other attributes of the files so there will be some commonly used files modules that uh, we will see in the in this video with some examples okay so using the files module we can um, basically do some of the uh, common task for example uh, you know creating the new file or copying the file from uh, one location from the uh, manage node or we can you know also copy the files from the control node to the managed node and uh, we can you know also edit the file or we can also remove the files using the files module okay so now uh, let us see an example to ensure a file exists on the managed host so let me create a playbook called files dot yaml okay here using files related modules and host will be i'm going to use server a dot scg.com host okay and task you can put some name here file module okay and the module name will be file and the path we want to ensure of that file exist is so i'm going to give sysadmin and ansible file okay next i'm going to set some owner the user ownership will be acg and the group ownership will be devops so you need to make sure um this group and user should exist and i'm going to set the permission zero four you can set any permission okay and uh, the state going to be touch okay so i am just in the new tab let me ssh to server a okay so let me check if this file exists let me become root okay so these were the files i have under root in server a so i'm going to create something in this location so there is no path like this so let me remove sysadmin and put root and uh, it's going to be ansible underscore file you don't see the file here 
okay now i'm going to save this and exit let me cat so here using the file modules we will touch on the managed host so it will touch file on the managed host uh, this will be uh, similar to the touch command which will create an empty file if this file doesn't exist and uh, in case if the file exists then it will update the timestamp for that file so in this example uh, we will be just uh, touching the file and uh, ensure that uh, the owner and the group permissions will be applied okay let me execute this playbook Okay, now if I go to server A and run the ls-l, so here we can see that ansible underscore file with the permissions that we have set and the user group ownership. Next, uh, copying and editing files on the managed host. So in this example, uh, we will use the copy module to copy a file that is located in the Ansible working directory on the control node to the selected managed host. So let me uh, use the same playbook. Okay, here name copy a file to managed host and we'll be using the copy module and here we'll be using the source and test for the destination so the destination let's give root Okay, I'm going to check which file I can copy. So this will be from the current working directory. I'll just uh, copy the index.html. So let me put index.html file to the destination to slash root. okay let me save and exit and let me run the playbook so the playbook has completed we can see okay the copy file module task is run so now if i check on the managed host okay we can see that uh, there is a index dot html file okay which is copied over from the control node next uh, to retrieve the files from the managed host we can use the fetch module and uh, this could be uh, you know used to retrieve a file for example uh, ssh public key from the uh, reference system and uh, we can copy to the managed host okay so right now uh, this is my managed host server a and uh, i'm going to copy the public key from this host to the control node okay so right now there is no key in that created There is no DNS. Let me 
so will be it will be 192.168.0.109 okay I'm just going to create keygen going to be a default location so now if I cd into that I see there is a id rsa pub file this is the location of that file so now I'm going to use the fetch module to copy the file from the managed host to the control node name retrieve ssh key from managed host here i'll be using fetch module and the source here it will be slash root dot ssh slash id rsa dot pub and destination Destination, I'm going to put a uh, sysadmin slash home sysadmin and Sibyl server a dot pub. Okay, let me save and run. Okay, let me execute the playbook. So now if I put ls-l, I can see there is a server a dot pub folder. Okay, under which we can see server a dot acg dot com. That's the, uh, the managed host name. Okay, under that, uh, the root of that uh, user public key that we have copied over. Okay. So that's it in this video and uh, we will see the remaining um, files modules in the next video. Thank you.